Zildjian's Starbound Tutorials. Hello guys, Zuljin here. Welcome back to another Starbound tutorial. Today I want to talk to you a little bit about tech upgrades that you can get. In these chests here, right above me that I'm pointing at, or tech chests that you can find in various locations, I'll have the descriptions below where you can find a wiki page that has a lot of the planet coordinates and some descriptions on how to get them. This item here is the 3D printer and technical console. If you hit the tech, you'll see all the text that you've collected in the left pane here which you can lock in simply select the tech that you want to get and hit lock in and you'll have access to that tech you can only have four slots equipped at one time and you can only have one tech slot active let's beam down to the planet surface and I'll show them off the particular planet that we're visiting today is Beta Orabelli 305 which is located in the Beta sector it's actually Beta Orabelli 3054A. This smaller planet right here. You can see the coordinates below if you want to come to this specific sector. So the first tech we have is Pulse Jump. Pulse Jump allows you to double jump once in midair, or if you're descending, you can hit jump as well to pulse up. The next tech we have available is Rocket Jump. Rocket Jump can actually hurt you a lot. You have to hold up while pressing jump, but you get a very high jump. If you land on any pixels below the level that you went down, you can take damage. So be very careful with this. As you can see, I just took 72 points of damage if you land a couple pixels below where you actually jumped from. The next tech we have available is Mech. You activate this by using the F key. And here's the mech. Right now it seems very bugged because it's very, very, very uh, low on damage, but cool and all the same. You have a small jump ability if you press space, and I, I'm, I'm not able to see anything else besides shooting like this, which you only do one to two points of damage on enemies. So it's not recommended to use this on any kind of difficulty of the planets, but it is really cool. The next thing we have, which is my personal favorite, is Gravity Bubble. I just got this. So Gravity Bubble consumes energy. Let me go ahead and take a band-aid right quick so I don't take any damage. Oh, and let me waste these guys too. I got guns from a pirate ship by the way, so <laughs> that'll be another tutorial. So with, with uh, bubble, Gravity Bubble, all you do is press space once you're in air and you can fly pretty much endlessly. So as long as you're holding space, you will continue to accelerate up. And if you let go space at all, you'll just, you'll plummet. The gravity bubble will go away and you'll just plummet. You can still take fall damage in this thing, so you gotta be very, very careful. But it is really, really cool for traveling. What I'm gonna do is head left here and get to a location with the tech chest that I wanna show you. And, um, and I'll show you how to get those. Stay tuned, I'll be back. Alright, we arrived at one of the bases where the tech chest is. If you move through here, which doesn't seem to have any enemies in it, and I've already cleared this location actually, but I've already cleared this on single player and multiplayer. You'll see these Tesla calls around here, which hurt pretty bad actually. You have to be real careful. I might actually die right here. <laughs> Let me eat a couple more band-aids. And what you'll notice is you have to go through a series of tunnels, and I actually just dug a shortcut here. And there you have the tech chest. This chest will have a random technique in it, and doesn't seem to be different powers on any different sectors as I've gotten the most powerful tech I have which I believe is the bubble in a beta sector and one of the weakest techniques possible which is the double jump the pulse jump in the gamma sector so I hope you found this tutorial useful like I said you can check the description below to see the coordinates well the web page with the coordinates to some of the texts that you can find in the game 
And um, happy hunting. Thanks for watching. This is Uljin signing off. Have a good one.